Bristol Health Partners is a strategic collaboration of NHS trusts, universities, the council and commissioners which has been designed to help improve patient pathways in health. We do that through health integration teams which are a collaboration between service users, clinicians, researchers and commissioners to make patient pathways more efficient and better for patients. We host four of them in AWP, psychosis, eating disorders, perinatal mental health and psychological therapies and we work very closely with the self-harm health integration team as well. Suicide is a devastating event and self-harm is the highest risk predictor of, of completed suicide. The Stitch Hit has worked with patients and people who have self-harmed to improve the experience in the emergency department so that magical moment we have got to change people's lives is not wasted. What is psychosis? What do people who have psychotic experiences receive from services? Uh, the Psychosis Hit brought together over 300 people during a film season at the watershed to begin that conversation. In our hit we're working with people with anxiety and depression and we want to increase access to psychotherapy using digital technology. Uh, we've developed a short film to help people decide if, this, if psychotherapy is right for them and we're evaluating a new online platform. The priority of the improved perinatal mental health team is to ensure there's an integrated pathway so that when women have mental health problems during or after their pregnancy, they can access help when and where they need it. We've supported the CCG to get the funding for a specialist team that will support that pathway. Transitions are really difficult in mental health. The transition between childhood and adolescence and adulthood is an example of a really difficult transition to manage when so much change is happening in people's lives. In the ED, ED hit, the eating disorder hit, we're trying to really tighten up the care pathways across the region so that all of the local services for adolescents can refer seamlessly into adult services. We're running a seminar for you to come and find out more about these health integration teams. You can ask them complex and penetrating questions, find out more about what their plans are, but also be involved in the development of those health integration teams, perhaps with a view to improvements in the STP. The seminar itself is on the 23rd of January. I'll be hosting, so it will definitely be fun. And we'd urge you to attend so that you can be involved in this process and think about how we can spread these innovations across the AWP area.